I'm going to quickly show you how to set a conibear trap. This is used to catch beavers. It's a body gripping trap and it does kill. So if you use this, be prepared that you're going to probably walk up to a dead animal. So there are three parts of this. You have the springs. You have the trigger mechanism and you have the dog. To set them, <clears throat> you take this. This is the way I set them. If you talk to 12 trappers, every trapper will show you a different way to set this. But here's how I do it. First of all, you get this thing against your knee at a slight angle, you press down. First thing you look at, you make sure these safety catches are over your springs. You never want to hold this thing like so, because the first thing that happens is those fall off, and this is a live trap. So you always hold it to where these things are at the top, and that way these don't fall off. Next thing I do is pull out the old safety catch. You take this, you stick that on there, and if these do come off, it holds it. Never take this off. It's the last thing to do. So we got our safety catches. We have three forms of keeping this trap from going off. We're safe. Another thing, you never stick your hand this way because if it goes off, it's really tough to open one of these with one hand. And if you catch both hands like this, you walk to your local road and have someone try to compress these springs or you just sit there and really hard to dial a phone when both hands are caught in this thing. And then your boss laughs at you. So you got it right here. Next thing, you take the dog, you flip it over. You get it right in this groove. There's a groove right here. You set it in that groove. You slight pressure off the springs holding the dog down. One hand to the spring, one hand to the spring, fully set, safety catch is still on. Now there's going to be another video where uh, they show you how to actually set this in the water with sticks and everything on beaver sites, so I won't get into all that. But when you have it set, you get out of the way because if your foot's right there, your foot's going to get caught. You move away, you ease your safety trigger off, and you come up. We have a trap that's almost ready, and don't forget this part. You forget that part, and then you just educated your beaver. And to show you how hard this thing hits, you ever set one of these off, or you need to close it, thumb in, hand down, that way you don't have something to get caught. Thumb in, hand down, thumb in, press away. That way when this thing comes up, it doesn't hit anything. Goes off. Now to set this, there's two methods. You can stick it between your legs with your safety catch going down. Compress springs. Like that. I don't recommend that way for someone who's just starting. Spend the $22 and save yourself a lot of heartache and use this big conibear setter. There's some that are smaller. Don't get the smaller ones because it takes more leverage. And on new conibears, the springs are very tight. You take that, you grab your springs, close it. You put your safety catch back over the other side. It's a lot easier. You don't get as dirty, but if you're in a swamp, you're going to be dirty anyway. But that's how you set a conibear. I do recommend if you're going to go set these traps, you find someone who's done it before and done it for a long time and have them sit with you and work with you for about three hours setting this thing and various, you know, if you have a beaver in there, it's harder to set or it's harder to take it out. Work with someone who knows how to use this because it's, these are very dangerous. 
uh, you catch it just right on your knuckle, you could break your hand. Work with someone, go with someone, learn these things with a professional. I do not recommend just going out and buying one and sticking it in the ground. Because if you do, you're going to go to the hospital right afterwards to get this thing taken off your hand. Go with a professional, learn how to do it, use it correctly, and use it humanely.